Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Celebrity couple Emma and Matt Willis are helming Netflix's Love is Blind UK, but where did their love story begin? TV presenter Emma, 48, is best known as the host of Big Brother and The Voice, as well as Channel 4 reality show The Circle. As for Matt, 41, he rose to fame as part of the aughts pop band Busted. The duo have been together for 20 years and recently celebrated their 16th wedding anniversary, which Matt marked by getting a tattoo of his wife's face. In 2022, the couple, who share three children, got candid about Matt's past difficulties in a BBC documentary titled, Matt Willis, Fighting Addiction. Through the ups and downs, they have stuck together and currently live in their £1.7 million home in Hertfordshire. As they undertake their first co-hosting gig since 2008 with their love front and center, here's everything to know about their life together. Emma and Matt have been married since 2008, having initially met in 2004 when she was working as a presenter on MTV and Matt appeared on the show with Busted. I'd see him wearing baggy jeans, wobbling around like a duck so they didn't fall down. He used to wear makeup and have weird hairstyles. But I remember thinking underneath all that was a really cute guy, Emma told Cosmopolitan of her first impression of her husband. Matt proposed in 2007 in Venice, and they were married a year later in Ruston Hall, Northamptonshire. Talking to usnews.co.uk about falling in love, Matt said, I think it happened over time, but for me it was never one thing. I was kind of like I'm going to ask her to marry me because I don't want her to go away. That was it for me. And Emma added that she always knew she was pulled towards Matt. They returned to the same venue to renew their vows on their 10th anniversary. Matt marked the occasion with a touching Instagram post in which he paid tribute to Emma, saying, I actually managed to hang on to her for 10 years, I'm still not sure how. I know I'm punching before you all comment that. I am the luckiest guy in the world. I get to spend the rest of my life with this kind beautiful powerful woman. She is the most amazing wife and mother and I could not be more proud to be her husband. Thank you for the best years of my life. However, he admits in the documentary that things have been tough at times, admitting Emma had come close to leaving him many times in the wake of his addiction, although Emma, too, has spoken out about her husband's struggles. I wanted to help him, she told The Telegraph in 2020. Your relationship progresses, and you realize that there is a real issue, and it's not just a young kid who has got a lot of money very quickly. Earlier this year, Matt marked 16 years of marriage with an Instagram caption, reading, I love you more than ever. 16 years and it keeps getting better. Meanwhile, Emma added, 16 years since we said I do. Love you forever Bab. Emma also shared a sweet message to Matt when he turned 40. I love you babe, you blow me away every single day with your spirit, strength and determination. Here's to living every day to the max together, always. Sick. Dot. Matt and Emma are parents to three children, Isabel, who was born on June 20, 2009, Ace, born November 26, 2011, and youngest daughter Trixie, who they welcomed in May 2016. The couple keep their children out of the public eye, choosing not to share photos of them online, although they do sometimes post snaps on social media with the kids hiding their faces. Despite this their son Ace has been hailed a style icon, and was previously praised for breaking gender stereotypes for having long hair and choosing to wear pink. Emma defended her child's choice to wear what he wants at the time, telling the son's fabulous magazine, Say what you want about me, I'm big enough to take it on the chin. But when you get comments like that regarding your children, it just makes the Hulk want to come out and scream at the world. Elsewhere, Matt has said that he watched his documentary with Isabel, saying the teenager is old enough to know about alcoholism. We watched it together and she had the most incredible questions, he explained during an appearance on the one show. I thought it was important as her friends or parents at school might watch it so I wanted to preempt her with that. I was blown away by her reaction to it. Love is Blind UK on Netflix is filmed.